Hello, this is Jamaica. I think everybody is in quarantine now. So, I wanted to make a quick video about how to play in Roll20. Uh, but just keep it as simple as possible. So, let's see. First, go to the Roll20 website. And here in the sync in tab uh, pressing up fill the boxes here and create your account well, it's pretty simple then let's go to the one that I already have in my account let's create a game So here goes the name. Here you put put your tags. Oh no, the yeah, MD5V. Uh, choose a character sheet. Well, we can choose the uh, let's see five E. Default five E character sheet. But we may maybe we won't be using that. Because I said, as I said, I'm trying to make the basic thing that you need to play. So here you choose a picture for your game. But I imagine that most people that are starting to roll 20 maybe already have a group. So what you have to do is just press invite players, copy this link, and send it to your friends. Then they will, will be able to join Roll20 and join your game. Well, what else? You have to put playing here the ND5E. Uh, you have uh, this is to put the, the when is going to be the next game. But as I said, this is possibly what people that doesn't have a group already, and I think most people that are moving here. I already have a group, so let's go to set up a simple game. So you press launch game. And here you have the chat where you can roll dice by just write and roll, for example, 20 plus something. And well, here are the basics of how to roll dice and send uh, whispers to your GM or, or specific player and what else and here's where you play you have now a blank page but you could for example It's a bunch of map tiles here. For example, we can use this one. And to set it up, just press your right mouse button and send it to the map layer. There is three layers. Objects and tokens, there is a layer that players can use to move their tokens. Uh, um, GM info overlay where only the GM can see this stuff and the map background, map and background. So we have for map and background. Press right button. Uh, press its drawing so it will not uh, stick to the grid when you scale it and then you can press align to grid so this allows you to use this tool to pick uh, let's do it again uh, console again 
nine squares, so it automatically will set it up to the right size. Like this. Okay. So then we put it in the right there. Well, it wasn't that perfect, so let's put it like this. Perfect. And here we can choose how many grids. So there is no grids or white grids. Also we can put the background black, so also there is no white there. Here. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, there. And then, well, Roll20 have a bunch of free tokens here that you can use. Let's put some, oh, should put them on the token layer. There. Mm -hmm. And that's pretty much what you need. If you're using your printed character sheets, you can just play today and learn more about World 20 as you go. Like for example, there is, uh, you know, character sheets here that you can use and roll automatically. Okay, so when you open your game, it's going to ask you if you allow it to use your camera and mic, I'm going to put no here because I'm recording with my mic <laughs> and that's it you can use uh, the camera and uh, sound from Rule 20 which are not that great or you can use Skype Discord or whatever else to to talk on video right and that's it for today I hope that's the basic you need to play on Rule 20 also you can just get a blank page and use here the, the brush and this drawing tools to draw basic maps instead of uh, having to to come with a an image of that of polygon lines and that's the basic there is like lots of things to roll 20 but that's pretty much the basic that you may need to play like right away I hope this was informative for someone um, have a good day keep rolling those dice and safe safe and stay at home goodbye <laughs>